A Scalelectrics track like the one I'm playing with right now is probably not far from what I used to play as a kid with both controllers in my hand because I had no friends. But uh, even seeing the lap counter over there makes me quite excited as they have picked up some serious speed. But we've got something a little bit better to show you today. Now this is more like it. Let me introduce you to gloriousness. The Scalelectrics dream of a six-year-old and probably 25-year-old me as well. This, have you guessed yet, is Silverstone. And my goodness me, we're coming through maggots and beckets right now. I didn't really know what to expect when coming here, but look at this. You've got Silverstone laid out here. You've got one guy, one very passionate, great British man with his Union Jack. You've got a pit lane there. You've got all this pit crew. Look at them. That guy's got a wheel out for nobody, but that's because the car's not there, because you know you have to put it there. But look at that. You've got, you've got the pits. You've got the wing. Look, this is all man-made. All man-made, can I just say. This took, I think, a one and a half months of three people's time to create this masterpiece. Even the trees feel real. Look real. Look at them, Alistair. Take a look at them. Don't look at me. Look at the trees. Most of the trees are handmade by turning wire, adding dried elements, and then sealing them with PVA. Easy, right? Wrong. To further enhance the detail and lifelike look, a 3D scan of the track is carried out in conjunction with capturing all angles in real life. This is so that they can reference as much visual material as possible when drawing them out on a 3D modelling programme. The wing in particular was created by looking at various diagrams and sketches, and also visiting Silverstone to really capture the somewhat difficult design to recreate, especially when you take into account that the majority of it is made of polycarbonates, and all with human hands. You've got the infield section as well, you've got stone circuit so not only have we got the main arena the main silverstone circuit we've also got stow inside let me just pick this up and we're gonna do a bit of rally no we're not cut we're gonna do a bit of rally all right i watched them do it and they could do drifting they were doing donuts and everything they were doing <laughs> oh that's it oh the 360 let's put that down now and if you wanted to have this, if you wanted to buy this, £15,000 or something around that kind of area is how much it would cost you to buy this. And it probably doesn't even come with the custom made stuff that these guys have built hand made. It's actually really awesome. The, the inner six year old is going mental. So not only do they have Silverstone, they also have Monza, the Autodromo Monza di Nationale or something along those lines. Has lots of trees, which I think fits quite well with the Monza theme. It also has the old banking, so there is nice little touches to this Monza track. Four lanes, double the fun of Silverstone, although Silverstone impressed me just that tiny bit more. It's just awesome, it has so much character. Should we have a go? I think we should have a go. It's, it's all well and good me talking about it. Let's dive into it. Here we are, you join us for the flying lap. We're about to come over the start finish line right about now and through turns one, two, three, and four really, really quickly. Now down, way to the straight, and now we're coming round towards the old pit straight now. Now through cops, now coming towards Maggots and Beckett's lovely jubby left, right, left. Now down, Stow, no down, that Stow, and around the final corner lap. So I used to have a scale electric set at home, a Nigel Mansell set. It was pretty impressive, but not quite the level of this. Do you guys have some at home? Do you have it in your loft? That's usually where they end up, is dusty and not used in the loft. But for me, I will never be able to have a Skeletric set unless it's something as good as this. After seeing this, my mind is blown. 